Ranjit Shah had this idea to uh, bring together an artist, like a visual artist, one person from a different field. It, just, it was more an instinct, a feeling that this was something exciting to be part of. So I think it was my first real um, in-depth in collaboration with a graphic designer. I think I've been waiting for it, uh, for this opportunity all my life, for somebody to come and say, that's not what you're supposed to be doing. You're supposed to be doing what you really love doing and start doing it now. It was good that I just sat behind the decks and like made some beats while he sketched. And it sort of like came together because he was understanding the music process. I think the primary focus was also humor and not get too serious about oh, I'm making yeah, this beat. And yeah, it worked. This video about Govinda and Jimmy Khatkar called Tumira Sukhuman that little bit of this really absurd lame dance and we both related to probably a really bad dancer. Yeah, that's a dance move we can all do because it's just this at the beginning. Instruction manual, so you can look at it and dance. Your friends can look at you and dance. I thought it'd be nice to have like some classic Hollywood quotes. Right. Something. I actually went through a lot of things. I mean, uh, history finally came together. Right? The whole takeoff of history as a woman and history as an element, as a product, you know, the entire Indian context. So basically, my idea was to uh, draw an uh, Indian woman uh, and history. And in a very robotic kind of way. Because you know, the whole idea of the Indian woman always looking pristine yeah. and still doing her uh, household yeah, work and still looking kind, of kind, of kind of quite beautiful and lovely. Knowing that it had to be Mumbai as a city, how to actually put it in a perspective which is in a space, it's, it's challenging. I think Bombay in very many ways resembles a spaceship. If you look at the human density, if you look at the kind of psychological and sociological stresses you have to go through to survive in Bombay. The inside machinery of the city that makes the whole thing tick all the time. All of these aspects are very similar to um, the extreme environment of outer space. Initially it was called the Bortuary um, on a Friday night, but we changed it to something a little shorter and more catchy called Frequency. You decided actually to come down to my studio and say, okay, cool, let's, uh, let's start the party. So actually I was playing you some of my funk stuff yeah. from the upcoming album and, and yeah, we played you it. were just drawing. So I wanted it to be minimal, wanted it to uh, focus on line work and also the idea that a sound wave is just one single line and when you do an illustration you're kind of taking a line on a walk and all these kind of things kind of interlinked in when I started drawing. 